Okay. But anyways, I will connect another another harder energy cell probably down here for these guys. Because they go through a lot of power when I'm crafting up a bunch of stuff. Okay, now it's working, is it? If I get close. Oh, it actually went through all the sludge. Huh. That's weird. Anyways, while this thing is working, when it has sludge in it as well, it will uh, give you the debuffs, like I said. Let me uh, just fix that. Ah, cool. So this is going to power up and get some energy in it. This work is going to, looks like, take a bit. I don't know if it needs energy or what. Ate all the sludge. Should output on any side, I think. Or is this the output side? Uh oh. Wait, no. They're equal. On either side. Let's see what happens when it gets full power. I doubt it'll need full power, but... Once again, I really don't know what these machines... Nope. Hmm. Why isn't it working? Does it output on top, maybe? Maybe it does. Let's try that. Really? That's weird. Yeah, so let's knock you out. Hmm. Maybe it just needs more sludge. That's probably what it needs. Put everything back the way I had it. Import. Export. There you go. I broke you, so you're going to need another bucket of sludge in you. Fudge. Do we have any sludge in the system? We do. Hmm. You should be putting the sludge into the thingamabob in here. Ow. Okay, there we go. It's working. So you see I got hunger and poison. Oh god, how far back do I gotta be? Okay, I'm gonna test its range real fast. Let me get some more cobble, because I'm going to want because I know this thing is set up perfectly, so just grab some cobble from there. So I'm just gonna completely encase this thing in cobble. You know what? That's good enough for me. Never have to go back here. Okay, so you get about here and it uh, starts affecting you. So, I gotta get out of here before I die. Okay, I'm about to die. Stupidity. Woo! Lucky me. So, I'm gonna fix that real fast. Put you in there, take that out. Now I should. Oh, I thought I fixed this. Never mind. Hmm. Take this plank back. Plank back. Oh my god, why am I retarded? There we go. God. There we go. It kind of freaks out your screen, but it speeds up the healing process, even though it looks like you're having a seizure. Let's see what that looks like. Oh yeah, I got a hat on. It's a squid. I thought uh, Cthulhu would want a friend. Okay, let's get out of this seizure indu inducing stuff. It's annoying the hell out of me. Okay, but we have a sludge boiler set up, and I'm pretty sure it's, it just outputs sand, dirt, possibly gravel, just really basic stuff. Eh, there we go. Can't really look at it, that's right. Okay, so we got that done. We got the fluid terminal. Sort of showed you how the fluid works. A little bit. Okay, what else is on the list to do? Sludge boiler check, transition plane check, fluid terminal. I'm not. I'm probably not going to store the lava yet because that's a lot more export buses or I'll just do it off camera. So you have to transfer all this into there and... Ugh. 
Oh yeah, I did upgrade this. I had another five crucibles. And to make it work faster, I gave it a uh, four speed upgrades, which you get with the recipe, and then two mining upgrades, so it mines three cobble per whatever. I make these is a little bit expensive on redstone, but I've got more than enough of that. And these is, well, these are pretty cheap, so you could pro I could probably max that out. Hmm, so let's try and craft a 64K storage. I should have everything I need. Let's see. Storage cluster, I've got that right here. Storage block right here. Storage segment there, and then storage cell is what I need. Block segment cell. It's gonna be expensive, so we're gonna craft this thing and yep, still trying to make cables. Okay, I'm gonna have to uh, craft it again. There we go. So now it's creating everything I need. Three storage cells, three segments, three blocks, and one cluster. Oh boy, let's go downstairs and look at this. Yeah, smelting up glass for me. Oh, the quartz one. Hmm. Ooh, spare one, give me this. Bam. Got some spares in here because I had to make more. Because these things are so damn slow. What is it crafting? I wonder if that broke it because I took it out. Might have. No, no, no. It's going. I don't know what it's doing. We'll let it run for a little bit. So where's my book? Oh, it's right there. Let's check off a few more things. Put down a drying rack. Okay, so what do we do? Transition plane, we got that. No, oh, I thought I didn't check that off. Huh. Some progress wirelessly. Well, now I got this for sure. If I didn't get it, if it didn't count the tank, I got that. Hmm. So you've sieve. 10 lucky blocks. I'm gonna craft those 10 lucky blocks. While we wait. Lucky blocks. How do we craft these guys? We just need 10 droppers. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Ten lucky blocks. Now, like I said before, these things have a chance to spawn any mob, including the Ender Dragon and the Wither. So, uh, the chance is astronomically low, probably like a 0.001% chance. But, in these types of games, in any game I've actually ever played, I have the worst possible luck in existence. So, what we are going to do is I'm going to back up the world, because I am not losing the world to an ender dragon spawn, or I'm not recovering after that. And I'm going to go build a platform somewhere. That's why I'm running around trying to figure out. Probably back over here, because it's the mob farm, and if the mob farm blows up, it's not a huge deal. So I'm going to get to work, make that platform, back up the world, and I will be right back. And hopefully by the time I get back, uh, that thing will be auto-crafted. So I'll be right back. Okay, <clears throat> I am back. and <clears throat> Sorry. I have built this little platform area, arena of death over here, away from my base. I've backed up the world just in case, because if an ender dragon spawns, I'm just going to save and quit and reload the world because I'm not dealing with it or the wither because I can't kill them. You know what? Give me one second because I'm pretty sure I have a bow back here with, I know I have infinite arrows. Oh boy, yes I do. Ooh, two or three. Let me see this. Uh, let me try and find a decent bow. Let me check in here. No decent bows. Okay, um, just give me one of these and one of these and one of these. What's in my tier three bag? Uh, Thomium sword, junk, you know what, just deposit the rest of it. Junk, junk, junk. No bows, oh well. I'll have to clean this out later. Dump any experience I have, good. Oh yeah, I added more tanks. Okay, I'm worried because now I'm trying to stall. I forgot the arrows. 
I put void upgrades in these so that they uh, any new items they get are voided instantly because I don't need any more stacks of uh, arrows or bone meal or that. I didn't put in the ender pearl one though because I can always use ender pearls. So uh, let's break these and hope for the best. Here we go. Lucky block number one. Oh, sweet. Golden bag of holding. This thing is... I like this too much. I don't want to die with this on me. This is now going to be my, if we survive, my, uh, whatchamacallit, tool bag. Okay, number two. Bunch of arrows and a bow. Better bow. I'll take that. So far, so good. Oh shit, oh shit. Ow. Okay, that hurt. That must have been a damage health potion thing. We're gonna probably stand back now. I'm gonna break these. As far back as I can. Yeah, let's let our health regenerate a little bit. Uh, put it up to normal. In case anything does spawn, I actually don't have any way of stopping it from following me back to the base. That was stupid. Ooh, what's this? Copper seeds. Bla oh, no, 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 no. Blaze seeds. That, that right there just saves us a trip to the nether. I will go to the nether, but that right there just saved us a trip. No, 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 I'm going to go deposit these somewhere up safe. There's no way in hell I'm losing these now. God, I hope these six blocks don't contain an ender dragon, because, like I said, I will be go back to the uh, save, the backup, and that means I won't have that. That'll suck. Bunch of arrows. Ooh, what's it? Ooh! The Essence Ho. Shift click tills a 3x3 area. Probably the worst possible tool I could have gotten out of all the Essence tools, but you know. Ooh. Cool. 29 red wool. Ooh. What the hell? What is this? What the fuck? Oh, sweet! Wait. Clay, 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 clay. Is that a diamond block? Ooh, son of a bitch, it is. That was weird, though. Because now I need to build a tower up. Because I don't have any uh things to get up. Because I didn't bring anything. Because I'm an idiot. Seriously, I didn't even break the right ceiling cobble piece. God damn. Magenta, pink, and a block of diamond. Lucky me. Three. Ow. That's okay. I'm broken legs are fine. Well. One, two, three. Well, we'll just have to leave that one open. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Oh shit. I don't want to break that. You know what? Let me just double check anything's up here. Nope. Okay, we're just gonna leave this open in case something falls again. Last block. Here we go. Oh my god! Okay. Seems to me we've got every single possible um, debuff. I'm probably going to die because I do have wither on me, so I'm just going to die up here. Hunger, poison, slowness, weakness, my wither. Yeah, wither's going to kill me. I'm going to eat this food. I'm dead. Yeah, withered away. So, amazingly, though, we did not spawn a single mob. I thought that last one, though, that scared me. I thought it spawned every mob possible. And, um, really just, I thought it did, uh, did every debuff and spawned a shitload of mobs. But it didn't, thankfully. So, I just built this little thing up here because, uh, I didn't want my, uh, items just to, you know, fall through the ground. So I built myself a little, like, grave. Okay. Well, job well done. We got blaze seed, so that just saved, you know, a huge trip to the nether. 
Uh, what else? Did I throw anything in here? The golden bag of holding. Okay, check. Now I'll put it in here. Wait, where did I put them? Oh, I was freaking out. Copper seeds, that also saves some essence. Wasn't there grapes? Huh. Yeah, well, I'll find those later. Okay, I'm, I'm kind of scared of lucky blocks. Organize my stuff. Okay, the book. The book. Make it for open. Ten lucky blocks. Yay me. Okay, I think that's enough for this episode. I'm gonna. Oh wait, duh. I gotta check to see. I think I have it. Yes, I do. My 64k storage drive. That is in tier two. Bam. I think it was an assembler. That all doesn't matter. I don't crafted it. So, I'm not going to put it into the system yet because I'm going to have to configure it because these are randomly getting filled up. I want to I want to move all these to 4K and then have that one down there as a backup. So, are we good now? Did I have anything else? Go to the deep dark open. Open 64. Oh, God. Killed wood. With under I'm pretty sure if I open another 54, I might spawn one of these two. Shannon book. Okay. This we can work on. I don't know what Ender IO is. Automatically, no. No. Okay, so when we come back on next episode, yeah, I might be able to fly, seeing as I jump and got blaze seeds. Uh, we'll work on transmit power wirelessly and create power from three different fuels. So let's put our book up. And have to sort out the rest of this crap. So. Have a good time when you're watching the video, and I will see you guys later. Goodbye.